So the superior petrosal sinus, a small narrow, connects the cavernous sinus with the transverse sinus. Then the inferior petrosal sinus is situated in the inferior petrosal sulcus, formed by the junction of the petrous part of the temporal bone with the basilar part of the occipital bone. We will discuss when we will be discussing the skull. So this groove is in between the two bones where they meet, so occipital bone and the temporal bone, petrous part. They meet at this and they enlarge the sulcus and this sulcus is for the inferior petrosal sinus. It begins in the posterior inferior part of the cavernous sinus, pass through the anterior part of the jugular foramen and in the superior bulb of the interjugular vein. So these two veins, sorry, these two sinuses, that is the superior and the inferior petrosal sinuses, they are starting from the posterior part of the cavernous sinus, one goes to the transfer sinus and one goes to the sigmoid sinus at the bulb of the jugular vein. So inferior petrosal sinus receives the internal auditory veins and veins from the medulla oblongata. So internal auditory vein, which is accompanied with the seventh cranial nerve, that is the facial nerve, with the vestibulocochlear nerve and the nervous intermediates. These three nerves, they are going through the internal acoustic meters. So internal auditory meters are internal acoustic meters. So these are accompanied by this auditory vein and this is received from the internal ear to the inferior petrosal sinus. The medulla oblongata, which just lies nearby, it also drains to the inferior petrosal sinus. Pons, which is also the part of this and the undersurface of the cerebellum, we discussed before also that the inferior group of the cerebellar veins they are draining either into the inferior petrosal sinus, they are draining into the superior petrosal sinus, they are draining into the transverse sinus. So this was the drainage of the inferior as well as the occipital sinus. So these were the veins which were draining into these four. And the superior cerebellar veins, they were draining into the straight sinus.